<laughs> As I promised earlier, um, that we would we'd ask you about Manchester United. And there, there's two things I want to talk about. So first of all, as I said earlier, David De Gea is coming to the end of his, his, um, his time, potentially at Manchester United, his contract is expiring. And it's relevant for you to talk about another goalkeeper and, and the legacy and the history that you have with that football club as well. So what do you think the thinking should be from Manchester United around De Gea? I think you've got an incredible goalkeeper, an, an incre not just an incredible goalkeeper, an incredible servant to the club. Uh, what is it, 11, 12 years he's been there. To, to, to be at any club for that long, I know, is, is, is a difficult thing. Uh, to, to be the number one at a football club the size of Manchester United is, is, is an incredible achievement um, and one that has to be really respected. And I think looking at his season, he's been asked to play a completely different way than he's ever had to play. But from what I'm seeing, I'm, I, you know, like I said before, you'll notice the things that go wrong, but there's a lot of things that are going right.